Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel, and this is um, the week of Patch Tuesday. We are Monday, October 12th, 2020, and uh, this, of course, means that this is the week where we'll have some security updates. So tomorrow, Tuesday, is the second Tuesday of the month. These are Patch Tuesday security updates. Let's hope that uh, this is going to roll out well. So, also, a lot of you have been asking me about the um, October 2020 update release and also some of the um, questions concerning the May 2020 update. Uh, it's interesting to see how many people have the impression that they're, they didn't fix or there's nothing fixed in the May 2020 update, when in reality, it's actually rolling out very well, and it is in um, a lot of people, one-third one of everybody at least is uh, now on the May 2020 update. Um, a lot of people are under the impression that, uh, you know, there's, uh, I've even seen some posts of people saying that, uh, well, you know, it's uh, been uh, halted and it's not rolling out because of problems, which is totally untrue as we are moving actually faster. And uh, that means that this month, when we get the numbers at the end of the month, I expect the May 2020 update to actually be the most popular version of Windows 10 now on PCs. For the October 2020 update, once again, it's a small update. A lot of people have been asking me, um, probably because they don't see um, or don't look at the videos completely. Uh, this is a small cumulative update. It will be just minor changes and it will be moving on to the uh, to uh, to the October 2020 update with, you know, just um, a, a pretty quick uh, update compared to what is usually a major update. There's still no official date. You know, the way that last time it happened, it's probably going to happen like this, uh, this time. Uh, Microsoft is just going to issue a little post saying, well, you know, seekers are going to start getting this and uh, you know the, the way that Microsoft has been working for a while so when they actually release it seekers are the ones that see it first seekers are people that just go to Windows update and check for updates manually then when that is passed they start moving it to, to the general mainstream Windows users um, as a optional update because this is an optional update the only people that won't have it optional is uh, everybody that is either on the October 2018 update. That version of Windows 10 is expiring next month. So in November, you'll have the last Patch Tuesday update. So that means they are pushing the latest versions on you. Right now, most of you are going to the May 2020 update. Um, and the May uh, 2019 update or the uh, the 1903 version of uh, last year what's going to happen is that you are going to start also being pushed towards new versions of Windows 10 because your version of Windows 10 is expiring in December of this year so if you're on the uh, May 2019 update the uh, 1903 of last year you're going to be pushed to at least the May 2020 update because your version is soon to expire also. So no official date yet for the release. Some people are saying that uh, it might start be uh, to, to be pushed um, tomorrow with Patch Tuesday. Um, we'll see about that, but they've got the month. I, we know it's this month and we know it's by the end of the month. Um, so at some point we'll have an announcement and we'll let you know that you know, seekers are going to start seeing the October 2020 update. So uh, lots of videos coming up this week. Of course, we'll be looking at the Patch Tuesday updates. Uh, for the other update also, a lot of people, um, so like I said, a lot of people thinking that the May 2020 update has tons of bugs. It's rolling out. And um, if you see it in Windows Update, uh, you should install it. It's, uh, it works great. It has uh, really nothing wrong if you see it in Windows Update. Once again, it's always a question of where you get it. A lot of people that have the problems are the ones that actually uh, forced it on their PCs rather than waiting for it to appear. And uh, even though, yes, there are a few blockers for some specific models of PCs, and that's the key 
to um, having a good upgrade. When something isn't right, you have a blocker, so you don't see it. If you see it, it should be okay. And for most people, and I look at the, the background noise, like I say often, for most people, uh, this is actually uh, upgrading very, very well uh, right now. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.